President Ruto on Wednesday presided over the pass out of 1,995 Ademsenjo police officers at the Embakasi Training College in Nairobi. Here the president issued a directive to police officers and the military to plant at least 10 million trees within Nairobi. Washirikiane na wizara yetu ya mambo ya mazingira vile vile na Kenya Forest Service mutapatiwa seedlings ama miche ya miti ndio mutusaidie kupanda miti hasa katika sehemu hii munayoishi ya Islands. The recruits who underwent a nine month training exercise were reminded to serve Kenyans diligently. The president saying his administration will ensure the men in uniform have been equipped with modern equipment which will be key in combating crime in the modern age. Kila moja wetu afanye sehemu ambaye ako naye ya kazi kwa uadilifu, kwa kujitolea, kwa bidii. Interior CS Kithure Kindiki was urged to have officers who are deployed in war-torn areas like in the northeastern and areas affected with banditry to undertake special training which will help them tackle the security challenges. To implement all the directives you've given to make sure that our security sector is free from engagement in political activities to protect lives and property to honor the constitution of our country and the laws of our country and to refrain from taking unlawful instructions. On police welfare, President Ruto said his government will keenly look into addressing issues of police remuneration as advised by the committee he appointed led by former Chief Justice David Maraga. Tomorrow another troop of GSU officers are expected to graduate at the Embakasi Training College will join their colleagues to serve the nation in different capacities. Franklin Wala, K24 TV.